Britain's coastline is not only beautiful, it is vital for wintering birds to rest and feed up over the harshest months. We may think our winters are cold, but not compared to the rest of Northern Europe. We welcome hundreds of thousands of wetland birds to our shores every year. From large to small, they gather together bringing life to wet, wild places. And among them is Europe's largest wading bird, the curlew. Long-legged, long, downward curving bill. It is a specialist of muddy places. It can get to parts other birds can't reach. The tip of its bill is exquisitely sensitive. It can find food deep beneath its feet. Its calls fill the air. And inland from the coast, the coastal fields and marshes are also rich in feeding opportunities. Curlews gather. Some will be from Europe, some locals. They badly need these wintering sites. Their numbers are declining so rapidly. Britain has lost half of its population in just 20 years. Right across Europe, these wild songsters are disappearing. With so many changes in the landscape, and so many pressures, the curlews are being forced out. Once a safe haven, our coastlines are changing. Year on year, the problems are building and intensifying. Our climate is getting stormier and wetter, making a hard season even harder. Flooded fields become too wet for foraging. It is often a struggle for wild creatures to find their space. try and carry on as they always have, as the world around them changes. But natural rhythms are disrupted by light and sound. Wide open coastal spaces are always in high demand, and the pressure of development is ever increasing. an urgent decision to make. If we want the winter air filled with the calls of water birds, and the curlew song to inspire us into the future, we have to protect and cherish the rich coastlines of Britain. <laughs>